Buffy's promised that there's not going to be any incidents like at my old school is obviously not one on which she can follow through. Here's an interesting example. This is from a video from a television show. Here we have a quote, quotation, quotation. This is exactly what Buffy says. This is a character in a TV show. So in this case, we have a citation that includes the director of the show and the name of the show and the year of the show and the minute and second at which the quotation is. Remember, if we have a quotation, we need to have the exact page number. But in a video, we would have the minutes and seconds. Well, the correct way to do this is like this. Director's name, comma, year that it was aired on TV, comma, and then time, which is minutes and seconds. You don't need to have the name of the show because that will be inside the reference list. Just like you don't need to have the name of the book and you don't need to have the name of the journal. Same idea. Just the director, the year, and the exact moment. Kind of like page number, the exact second and minute. In 1988, a federal report observed that the current high level of attention to childcare is directly attributable to the new workforce trends. And this is from United States Department of Labor, 1988. And in this case, we can see that we have the quotation, quotation. What we see is different here is this little piece here again. APA is very specific about this. The APA is crazy about this stuff. You must follow the rule exactly. And the APA has a list of abbreviations. And here we can see this exact example where US is to be abbreviated as capital U period S, capital S period. And then we're going to have the specific department this has no author. This is a report from an organization like a company or a government department. So hard to see that difference, but that's the way the APA rocks. The play presents an opposition between two worlds associated with the two lovers. Zender, 1994, page 138. Romeo and Juliet's language of love nevertheless becomes fully responsive to the tag of actuality, Zender, page 141. Now, right away we can see that there's a little bit of an issue here, and that is we've repeated Zender, 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 and remember, if we're inside the same paragraph and you're citing the same author, the same paper, the same year, everything's the same, you don't need to repeat. But in this case, we have a quotation. Here's quotation. Then we have a second quotation. Quotation. These two quotations are from different places inside of the book or inside of the paper. So we don't need to repeat Zender. We don't need to repeat the year here. But what we can do is add the page number because it is a different page. So that's a great little example. You follow the same rule of inside the same paragraph, you do not need to repeat. But if you have something different, like the page, because the quote's different, then you need to include that one different thing. Okay, so that's APA inline citations. That is the citations that go inside of your sentences when you're writing. Lots of special rules, some exceptions. And so how do you get over that? In my case, I get my ebook and I keep it at hand. And every time I have a question, I look it up to make sure I'm doing it correct. And then I stick with that the whole way through. Special cases, I'm very careful to pay attention to ordering of authors and ordering of dates. Really watch out for and double check. Good luck with writing your citations.